The cat is obviously an instrument of the god of chaos. <laughs> Solomon does not believe in gods. If not for Sandra, he would cook the cat in a slow pink oven. If not for Sandra. Plug them in. Please. You'll never say please. you a seltzer? No. Cheese? Uh, mm. uh, no. Sure. No. Are you allergic? Do you have allergies? To cheese? To anything. Cats? No. Cats used to make me itch and wheeze. Oh, interesting. But they say that allergies cycle through every 11 years. Mm-hmm. And I've had a cat now for two years, and it's, it's, it's really more of a psychological torment. Enough! How do you feel about women? My want is infinite. If I let it loose, I would fly away. What do you love about women? Their soft curves, their sweet, high, melodious voices, their scent lack of body hair. Oh, some of us are very hairy. <laughs> and stench. Not you. And their nurturing disposition. <laughs> Do you flirt? <laughs> I don't want to make anyone uncomfortable. You don't have a girlfriend, right? Yeah. No. No. And you're not married? Yeah. No. No. Do you have any female friends? That is all they ever want. Mm -hmm. Do women make you nervous? The blood vacates the prefrontal lobe. It's scientifically proven. They, they, they show it on fMRIs. Hmm. What would you say if we asked you to cook a meal with a smart, beautiful, fun woman? Blood vacates Thomas's prefrontal lobe. We are testing out a new computer. We've named him Matthew. You named it. He will instruct you on a simple meal preparation. His instructional ability can be applied to education, medicine, military, tons of uses. And it all starts with a simple plate of spaghetti. That's it? That's it for now. The rest is up to... Everybody. Everybody in the world. Everybody here. Mm. And Freenie. Who? Freenisha. Who is that? Oh. 